day two at slave labor. I mean, back in Canada. I want to drink gas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're just gonna clean this guy. It'll be easy. So something really unfortunate happened, which is why my face is so cropped. Um, between washing, we took washing the wall, me and Ben, we took a short break. I set my camera on top of a car and Dan went into work with the car and the camera fell off. He, he rescued it. However, the lens It was totally beyond repair. Check that out. Um. I recorded a monologue yesterday from a vlog that I tried to make, it just didn't work out. Alright, I don't know if I'm in focus. I'm going to try and vlog for one more day. And you'll never see it because I'm never going to fully edit it and release it because there's no story. So basically my camera is jacked up. Um, it still records as I'm recording on it right now. This is the camera I've done the whole vlog with. Um, however, it only turns on maybe one out of every ten times I flick it on. So everything I had to do yesterday for the vlog that won't be released... One, two, three, go! Got some good things, but it's way too hard, especially with this lens that I'm using. I caught moments, but most of my stuff was thought out because things don't usually happen for more than like a minute it's I try and turn it on I'm clicking clicking the moments over but I, you know maybe I'll catch something else it's not really worth it I don't have any other cameras uh, to use so I think this is a great time uh, not really how I wanted to end the vlog but I think it's a great time to end it 60 some odd episodes I did and I think what I learned from that is it's good to do something every day um, the vlog made me never bored because if I was bored sitting down doing nothing I would just get up grab my camera and find something to do um, it made me more proactive in life um, and other stuff but if you want to do something you get that done by doing it and not by thinking about it but by doing it I love the vlog because every day I had to have a video done so I had to go out with my camera. No matter like if, if it was a really annoying thing to hold on to this chunky, clunky camera in the city, I would just carry it in my hand all day and get used to it. Not vlogging anymore because I know that the videos that I come out with, with my janky camera, would not be as good as I would like them to be. And I wouldn't be able to tell stories that would be worth telling. So, if this is the end of the vlog, unless like a miracle happens and I get a new camera or something starts working, then the vlog will be over right now. Strange idea.